If you're a Volkswagen bus fan, you likely have the patience of a saint. First, because if you drive an old one, it's not quick. And second, if you're waiting on the new one, it feels like this wait has taken some time. But there is electrified light at the end of the tunnel. Volkswagen has confirmed that the North American version of the ID Buzz will show its face in June. And then one year later, you can buy it as a 2025 model year vehicle in the summer of 2024. Volkswagen makes a few versions of this thing. So which one are we getting? Per VW, our US bound ID Buzz will be the seven passenger model. This is the longer wheelbase variety, which packs three rows of seating inside. Over in Europe, there's also a shorter wheelbase model, which features two rows of seats. And I'm not sure why we can't have both, but I do know that the longer one will be the better choice anyway, if you were thinking about going the Westphalia route. By that, I mean, I'm sure we're gonna see quite a few of these things turned into fun EV camping rigs. In fact, VW already makes that model and it's called the ID California. Who knows if that one is coming over here, but if it doesn't, that's a serious missed opportunity since car camping and overlanding is big business at the moment. If you're getting the itch to go camping now and don't wanna wait, pop on over to Auto Trader and suss out an old school yet still cool VW bus that's already set to hit the trails. As for the modern version, there's also a model called the ID Buzz Cargo, which is just what it sounds like, a cargo version. And that one could also be perfect for the van camper person who wants a DIY canvas to build upon. But again, who knows if that one will make it here too. What I do know is that the ID Buzz we're gonna see on our local dealer lots will first be offered as a rear wheel drive model with a single motor and a battery pack larger than the 77 kilowatt hour pack found with the short wheelbase model. The single motor ID Buzz will deliver 201 horsepower and 229 pound feet of torque. Not long after though, I expect VW to roll out its dual motor version that gets all wheel drive and nearly 300 horsepower. So how much is this thing gonna cost? We don't have numbers yet, as VW is keeping this all quiet, but likely until they show us the US spec van in June. I hope that the base model remains in the mid $40,000 range and an eventual dual motor keeps things in the low $50,000 range. If VW then adds in the ID California into the mix, you can expect that one to fetch in the upper 50s to even somewhere in the 60s, depending on what Volkswagen offers on the inside with respect to a camping setup. Still, this is all speculation until we see the thing this June and Volkswagen starts doling out all the facts, specs, and numbers we're eager to hear. So, are you one of those folks patiently waiting for this thing or has your patience run its course?